City of Glenwood Springs has joined organizations and individuals protesting a limestone mine determined to expand. The city and protesters say the expansion may threaten Hanging Lake and Glenwood's famed hot springs. They also claim trucks would damage local roads and highways. Mackenzie Quigley has the story. Expanding it is, is just not good for this community. The 17-acre mid-continent mine in Glenwood Springs extracts limestone for construction, runways, and concrete. Glenwood Springs Mayor Ingrid Wusu tells me the city and citizens worry the quarry may expand. Back in 2017, the mid-continent mine announced plans to increase their original 17-acre lot 26 times to 450 acres. A plan that screeched to a halt after several organizations and governments, including BLM and Garfield County, decided to measure the impact the expansion would have on the environment and Glenwood Springs. The impact of that expansion would hit us across so many different platforms in the community. Wusso fears the expansion could affect the integrity of Hanging Lake, crowd roadways with construction trucks, or even impact the temperature of Glenwood's famous hot springs. She tells me protests built across Glenwood when the mine announced the expansion, but the protests died down. I think there's some confusion that it's been resolved, and it has not been resolved. Rocky Mountain Industrials first pushed back against the mine in 2018. Glenwood Springs Assistant Attorney Richard Peterson Creamer says there's been a bit of reprieve. They filed for a, a modified plan of operations, and that triggered a uh, National Environmental Policy Act, NEPA, review. BLM finally said, okay, we're going to put the brakes on the NEPA review until we get the DCV completed, and that was a big that was a big moment. The quality of limestone is key to whether the mine expands. FAA regulated airport runways require higher quality limestone than concrete or general construction. The quality and what they're actually using it for doesn't pertain or justify the expansion or even what they have, they're claiming they're using it for. And that's the process we're currently working through now is to determine whether or not that mine should be considered under the 1872 mining law or under more common variety, which is more similar to a gravel quarry. The 1872 mining law pertains to precious metals like gold, platinum, and silver, but the mine claims limestone is high enough quality to consider it under this law. But you're not selling it for those purposes, so we're not going to recognize that it's locatable for the most part. We'd like BLM to uh, look at the existing operations and, and make a determination about um, whether it's legally uh, in compliance with the 1872 mining law. Anything and everything that we can do to stop the expansion is going to be good for the region. Reporting for KREX News, I'm Mackenzie Quigley. The BLM will hold the final determination on whether the, whether the mine is allowed to expand or not. We'll have more news coming up right after the break. Stay with us.